Hey guys, what's up? Um, I know it's been a while since I made an actual video on this channel, but um, I got a mock-up that I really want to share with you guys right now. And compared to the last video that I've done, so far this video is probably going to be really special to me, and probably really special to you guys. So, um, <laughs> now remember, the last video that I've done was just only a mock-up, sorry about all the noise in the background I'll do to my computer that's been driving me insane. Sorry if I, you know, haven't made a video over the past, um, you know, while. It's just I've been so busy working and uh, trying to save up some money here and there. So, um, but uh, yeah, you know, uh, just trying to show off this uh, what you call a prototype or sort of a mock-up build, like the last video that you seen in the hoverboard. Um, this video is kind of a bit different today. So, uh, yeah, you're probably wondering where I've been searching up for the, uh, correct details of the parts here. I'm kind of nervous. Here we go. I'll explain all this in a little bit. I just wanted to show you, ham around, you know. Alright, so this took me uh, quite a while to do, actually. But this is just a mock up, like I said. Now, the only thing about this is, um, the back part here for the, uh, decal is just a piece of paper. Later on, I'm going to go put this, uh, on my USB hard drive that I have. And basically, this is just a piece of paper that has printed out, uh, that I found on Yahoo. But the only thing about this is that this is not the correct version of this one. Now, I'm trying to find, like, the front part, you see how it's yellow? I'm trying to find the back part here that's yellow. This part right here is very rare. Now, I know it doesn't match because of the lines right, the, the green lines right there. And it looks like a shape of a W, right? But, yeah, this thing right here, the little um, part where you put your feet, that's just a, a piece of paper that I painted. quick little overall with the paint and this paint uh, made it green cut you know print it out cut it out into this this uh, shape that I need and um, yeah so the back part I know it took quite a while for me because I was busy this part I found on Yahoo believe it or not because Yahoo had, you can search up um, to find this part you can just uh, you know search up uh, hoverboard stickers or hoverboard decals, you know, something like that, from Back to the Future Part 2, and it'll literally have this part right there for you. Um, but I'm still trying to find the correct uh, piece, you know, kind of like that'll match the yellow part that goes back here. So, just like this part right there in the front. And the bottom part is kind of interesting. Remember what I told you guys from before? Uh, which is this part right here. I have this uh, taped up in the back at the moment. But when I do it like this, it just means this part just tilts forth with the tape right there. But, you know, this is just temporary. This is, like I said, it's just a mock-up, you know, for now. And um, I'm going to get this one. Later on, I'm going to get another one for the back right there and the battery battery pack right there and the other two parts that I need which is the um, uh, the molded I don't know if it's going to be mold 
I don't know how I'm going to actually do this, but, um, yeah, so this is kind of interesting that I have. So this is for the, uh, the hover part, you know, with the magnetic, and where the disc is going to go, or it's going to be painted silver. But I'm not going to use the cardboard. This is just a mock-up. Later on, once I get plywood, it'll all make sense. And then you guys are going to be like, wow, seriously? Yeah, I am I'm dead, I'm dead serious about building this because I've always wanted to build uh, a hoverboard. So that way you can put in your DeLorean. Although I wish I had a DeLorean, that would be kind of cool. So, um, but yeah, you know, this is like one of my greatest achievements right here. So, um, later on, once I um, plan to get some plywood and I'll just cut it out to the exact shape of the hoverboard. Now, what's amazing about the decals is that once you print it up, it's about the same size of this anyways, you know, like literally the same size brought to you by Mattel. So, I know Mattel is already making the hoverboard right now, but I don't want to make my own, you know, but this will be kind of a fun little side project that I seriously want to do. And, um, I know it's missing the little pink part right here that you put your feet on, the little trap, you know? <laughs> this is also tape, as you can tell. You can't see it, but it's there. So, um, yeah, I'm really happy the way how this turned out. I'm gonna possibly green screen this, so I'm not gonna pretend it's like hovering. But, you know, um, I saw a video on YouTube, it was so amazing, about a hoverboard being on placed on two magnetic, uh, being, uh, magnetic, uh, levitation, um, you know, beams or something like that, but, um, he had a hoverboard just like this one, but the actual one that it's used as a prop, and I'm like thinking, all he did was just took the two bottom parts off, and he put those little magnetic levitation, uh, the ones that you plug in, you know, and uh, I was like thinking, well, that was pretty cool because um, he put that underneath the disc right here. The um, what you call it? The, um, there's a name for it. It's the you know part that hovers. But uh, seriously, he made it to look absolutely amazing. I'll place a link underneath that uh, underneath this video so you can watch that video. That really amazed me a lot. So I, I was just like, wow, the way. And um, definitely go check out his videos. Well worth it. For the decals, all you have to do is just go to Yahoo and you'll find, just look up uh, BTCF hoverboards, um, you know, stickers or decals for the video. Uh, you'll find these right there. And you know, just print it out and then go to Office Max and. Um, Say you want uh, to get like a sticker, you know, type um, printout material, and then once you get your plywood, this is about two feet in length. Okay, this is two feet, and I just cut out the cardboard to be exactly as the way uh, this part is right here. You know, a little kind of like a skateboard type shape. You know, so. Um, yeah, I know it's a little bit off right here, because the, the L and the T, or the T E L is kind of a little bit off, but uh, I can fix that in a big deal. Um, all I have to do is just uh, cut out another piece. I'm probably going to just have to print out another piece right there and cut that part out soon. Um, or another piece of paper and just print this front part up. So, uh, yeah, there you have it. This is my one and only mock-up. I love it. I love the way how it turned out. So, there's still a lot more work to be done to it. And, you know, if you're seriously about thinking of building your own hoverboard, this is the way to go. I mean, if you, if you seriously are serious to buy one on eBay, <laughs> Maybe one day I'll, I'll buy one on eBay, but you know, for now, I like to, to you know, to get creative and build one just like this. You know, I have a blast with it because I, I love it so much. This is amazing. So, um, for now, uh, later on, I'm gonna go get some plywood. I'm gonna, uh, you know, finish up this bad boy, and um, yeah, you know, 
know it, it will be good. So, uh, thank you guys for the original comments from the first video that I made about the hoverboard. It really means a lot to me. And, um, yeah, more videos on this very soon. You'll see, this will be completely 100% done. And, um, right now I just have to cut out, uh, the plywood part. It's going to make it more easier. Now, for this part, that's going to be a tricky part right there, once I've filled it. It's about, I'll say, uh, at least maybe 11 inches, 10, probably, yeah, probably uh, 11 inches in the length, and an inch and a half, like that big, which is for the back part to lean up like that. So that's going to be kind of a challenge right there. So. Um, maybe I just might keep it straight like that. I'm not quite sure. We'll see. <laughs> so, until then, thank you guys for stopping on by and watching this channel and subscribing to this channel if you want more videos on uh, the actual tutorial itself on how to build one of these. Um, send me a comment down below and I'll place the link to that YouTube video that I was talking about. That was so awesome. Uh, it just made me, um, it made me cry a little bit. <laughs> I was like, that was so awesome. I love it. So, anyways, um, until then, I'll see you guys later. This video is well over 11 minutes long. Alright, so, bye.